And as I live and breathe, and M Bison, there he is. We got two, we got two final bosses. We found him, Dan Freeman. Don't be free, man. And why not Sebastian? Listen, Bison against a character like Akuma. One bad combo, it's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt real bad. This is uh, terrifying for Akuma. I think Akuma's just in general like a terrifying character to play in long brackets because while you have everything. One false move and things can go by the wayside so, so quickly. The Psycho Bomb set up, looking for that back heavy punch and the drive impact. Uh-oh. Oh, oh yeah. the bomb detonates off timing that Dan did, on a timing that Dan did not want and not able to follow up with it. Instead, it is all Sebastian with this combo. Sets up Oki, just going for the dash up into some lights, keeping things safe. Here we go, man. You can kind of like go back to this, this whole strike throw game with Bison, but like, listen, if with a character like Akuma and the health that he has, bro, you gotta be careful that like oh, nice tech. You gotta be careful that you don't stick to your like your your original game plan for too long. This is the third time he tried to do devil's reverse for the hit and he got DP for it for a third time. And he has to be really, really careful that he's not telegraphing too hard. The thing about Bison is he can be extremely tricky getting hit out of the psycho crusher and literally thrown butt into the corner. Goes, why not Sebastian? Some, uh, why not Sebastian in total control of this right now? He wants some of these forward heavy punches. He's looking at that spacing. Look at the patience from why not Sebastian. Just chilling in the corner. Sets up for the side switch. You are in burnout and a nice cross up there from Dan. Trying to represent so much of this pressure because you have all the resources in the world against someone who just can't take it. Right. You see him blocking literally in the corner. Yes, get all of your damage, my friend. Oh, okay, not choosing to spend any, uh, even like a level one and during that combo to close things out. I understand saving meter, but at some point you gotta, gotta spend a little bit of cash if you're gonna secure a round off of it, especially since you have one more round to go. With a super aggressive approach, bro, and, and you have a pistol round, you might as well just use at least a, a level two at the very most, but hey, uh, why not Sebastian says, hey, uh, I'm gonna use the meter if you don't, don't worry. Overhead and tries to get him with the with the low forward. Not going to be found here. You reach, I teach. That should be it here. You're whipping combos, my friend. The bomb setup. This is huge. Bison actually, Bison could actually win this. Yeah, this is. Oh, this is the burnout as well off of the psycho bomb. You get the level three critical art. Let's see how much damage this does. Oh yeah, you might be at twenty percent. Yikes on bikes. Oh my goodness, right. do we have a guest for game right here? Yes sir, and that's a good night. Punish counter, <gasps> you don't get the punish and you, oh my god! The tech throw, but he's got the fireball instantly after that tech throw. That is such a dangerous tool to use off of a tech throw because you have enough frames to jump over the fireball if your opponent reads it, but did not re read, did not react in time and the fireball closes out the first game in lightning like firework fashion yeah i think with that psycho x on the punish counter he got way too much dip on his chip the state jump set up though by why not sebastian into the corner dan freeman looking a little free man oh yeah big time combo coming up the meaty fireball do you get another six jump set up no then the buttons the mash the with throw here we go bomb set up not a ton of damage here, but on a pixel of health, you cannot risk going into burnout. You cannot risk cashing out on any sort of combo, trying to step forward, but gets the crouch jab in order to take the round. Why not Sebastian? Holding on sometimes by the skin of his teeth, but holding on nonetheless. Yeah. Unfortunately, my man Dan Freeman, he has not been able to just utilize that, you know, not utilize, but not get a game plan going. But this is the first time we've seen it. Gets the OD right here, but burns himself out. Gets the throw. When you have that bomb on Akuma, you have to keep applying the pressure. And it has just not been represented here. Yeah, it's like a school of two different thoughts, right? He's in burnout, so he doesn't want to apply the pressure. But he also set up bomb. And when you have bomb set up, that's your go time. Because you have that autonomous uh, hitbox ready, able, and willing to cover some of your risks. Like, it's free pressure. It's, 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 go, go apply it. Yeah. Like, free o'clock. Here you go. 
Oh, the tech throw, but he misses the heavy punch. That man, I'm <laughs> bro, this man, get, he got the crouching medium kick and didn't drive rush cancel off of it. Able to put him back in the corner. This strike right, throw game man. not working out. And if you want to go blow for blow, you have to convert right here. No, you're dead. Oh, my God. Why not, Sebastian? Oh, my Lord. That was a little bit of a... A little bit of some scrappy finishes from both sides. We saw the uh, the drive rush off of the crouch medium kick and looking for drive rush hit, drive rush 